Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we are back with another very famous question. The question is longest common prefix. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And let's see what question says. The question says write a function to find the longest common prefix string amongst an array of strings. If there is no common prefix, return an empty string. And we are given with a note that all given inputs are in lower case letters a to z so let's see the question says we are given an array of string flight so we need to return the longest common prefix so prefix are f f f l l l so these are the longest common prefix. Why? Because they are the same in the every single string in the array. So it's pretty obvious that we need to compare from the starting of every string to the all the remaining string in the array, and all the all the alphabet which are all the letters which are common, we will put them in a string and we will return it. And if nothing is common, then we will just return an empty string. But let's see a question, an example before it. Suppose you have given a question in such a way. B, 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 C, B. B, 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 C, B, A. B, 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 C. B, 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 C, A. B and B A. So the question is can our longest common prefix can be larger than this value? No. Right? It can't be larger than this particular value. Doesn't matter like if you have like 10 elements, if you have 10 string in an array, if nine of them have like four elements and where the the tenth element 10th string has a length of 2, then our longest common prefix can never be longer than 2. So, this will really gonna help us in our question that our longest common prefix will no longer, will not gonna be longer than the length of the smallest string in the array. So from here we can get one thing that first of all we, we need to take out the minimum length means the length of the shortest string in the array. And another thing like suppose I say you A B C and B C B and I ask you that give me this particular element how will you gonna get this so and suppose the name of this is str so you will simply say str 1 1 So, in this way we are pretty sure that this thing, if we see this question, this particular question, this thing, this is how we will gonna see and we will gonna move out in our string. So it's pretty clear that the what whatsoever the, be the value in this, we know no longer will gonna be the longer than smallest string in the array. It will never gonna be longer than the smallest string of the array. And what about this? This will move along the length of given array. 
so these are the two things we need to take care of first is that we need to find the smallest string then we will take our the length of smallest string and this is how we will gonna move forward so let's see how we can do this question so first of all let's take the edge cases if length of string given string is zero what we will gonna do we simply return empty string now what we need to do we have to find the length of smallest string in the array how we will gonna find that first of all we will make a min length variable and we will assign the value of length of first string in the array strs at index 0 whatsoever with the string at index 0 we will consider it as a we will consider the length of that particular string as the min length and now we will make a for loop and while moving forward we will compare with every element length of that very particular element the first ele first string we will compare it with the length of the all the remaining string in the array and we will gonna keep updating our min length so for i in range length of string minimum length will gonna be min of length of i and min length so while moving forward we will comparing the length of string with the min length and we will keep updating if we found something less than that so we found the minimum length now what so they clearly said that if you don't have any longest common prefix what we have to do we just have to be empty string so lcp let's take lcp as a empty string if we don't found anything similar we will return lcp and i told you this is how we're gonna move forward this is how we move forward in a 2d array and you can see we compare so let's take i as 0 and while i let's i is here and suppose j is here so we say i so i will always be gonna lower than the minimum length and what is minimum length the length of smallest string in the array so while i is less than minimum length let's take one more variable character cha and what will take string it will take the first element of first string so 0 and i so if we see in the example flow so it will take f it will take f now for j in range 1 to length of string if string j i because we need to compare every element of the all the strings not equal to character suppose what it's saying if f is this f is not equal to this element first letter of first string is not equal to the first letter of second string what we'll gonna do we'll stringly we'll simply return lcp which was empty string for now else if we found that they are matching we will simply add it to lcp lcp plus and we will keep increment the value of i 
and at the end we will return lcp i think the question is clear and the logic is also clear let's see what can be the code for this very particular question so let's first take care of the edge case if the length of string is equal to 0 so we'll simply return empty string and now let's find the minimum length which will gonna be equal to the length of smallest string in the array and let's give it name min length equal first of all let's take is the length of the first string in the element first string in the array for i in range now while moving forward we will compare the length of the first string in the array with rest of the string and if we found something less than that we will update our min length to the that particular if smallest length min length equal to min length of string at index i with min length so this is how we will find our length of smallest string in the array and if if you found anything if you don't found anything common in the all the string in the array we will simply return empty string so let's take lcp so like if if we don't found anything we will return this lcp so let's take i as zero and while i is less than min length and let's take a character so that we can compare string of 0 with i so it's a f so we take character as a first first letter of first string in the array like suppose we here we will take f so char will be f for first time for j in range 1 to length of string if string j i not equal to character what we will gonna do we will simply written the above lcp else what we'll gonna do we will add the common character in char and we will keep incrementing the value of i by one and at end we will simply return lcp so I think everything is fine. Yeah, so everything is everything worked fine. So this was the code guys and please don't forget to subscribe and if you have any any suggestion for us please leave it in the comment section and you can also tell us the next question so you can write it down in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a nice day.